In this video, I will show you how to fix an iPhone XS Max that got stuck on the black screen of death after iOS 13.6. Shortly after updating their devices to iOS 13.6, some owners reported that their units got stuck on a black screen and would no longer respond. It might be just a coincidence that such a problem occurred after an update, but it's something that we have to look into. If you're one of the users with this problem, here's what you need to do. First solution, force restart your iPhone. Most of the time, when a high-end smartphone like the iPhone gets stuck on a black and unresponsive screen, it's due to a firmware crash. You can fix it by doing the forced restart. To do so, quickly press and release the volume up button, and then the volume down button. Immediately after that, press and hold the power key for 10 seconds. This will force the phone to boot up. When the Apple logo shows, release the power key and wait until your iPhone finishes the reboot. In most cases, this procedure will fix the problem. So if you're able to make the logo show on the screen, that's a sign that the problem is fixed. However, if your iPhone remains unresponsive and stuck on a black screen, what you need to do next is charge it and do the forced restart while it's connected to the charger. Here's how. Plug the charger to a working wall outlet and connect your iPhone to it using the original cable. Regardless of whether the iPhone shows the charging sign or not, leave it connected to the charger for at least 10 minutes. After that, do the forced restart again while the iPhone is still connected to the charger. If the problem is just due to a minor issue caused by the new update, then it should be booting up by now. But if your iPhone XS Max is still stuck on the black screen of death after doing these procedures, then the problem can be with the hardware. With that, you need to have the device checked. I hope that we've been able to help you. Please support us by subscribing to our channel and enabling the notifications. Thanks for watching.